Hi, I'm Jay and I'm an inventor and to invent just means to discover, to, which most important part of which is exploring and looking around. And I was looking for something that would allow me to and allow others to better adapt the reality and make more easily. And I was lucky enough to discover Benius Infinity Wax. Now, I am certainly not the first person to discover the incredible properties of beeswax. Our relationship with it goes back thousands of years and it has played its part in transforming and shaping the world around us. But I'm not here to talk to you about that. I'm here to talk to you about Benius Infinity Wax and exactly what you might do with it. Benius Infinity Wax is a very, very simple product. It's beeswax, you can sculpt it, you can roll it, you can mold it, you can shape it, and above all, you can stick things together with it very, very easily, and then take them apart again. Now, this seems like a very, very simple, basic thing, and you're like, wow, what's so special about that? Well, essentially it means that you can take anything that you can buy in your local supermarket, for example, like cocktail sticks or uh, kebab sticks like this and you can form complex geometries you can make things in big you can make things in small this one is just built by matchsticks uh, the matchsticks especially actually if you put the match inside them burn them outside and safely they can be the ultimate fire starter and you can create your own small burning man festivals with this that's another thing you can do which is a lot of fun you can also easily make a bearing for example just by wrapping a piece of paper around a stick and sticking the paper to itself then you can add some fins and make yourself a windmill like so and by the same principle of making bearings you can also find bottle tops and you can combine them together and you can then use those bottle tops very easily to make yourself some wheels for example so you can build your own car that's just a few examples of what you can do with this wax you can also combine it with um, dimension sticks which um, copy sacred geometries or the golden ratio whatever you want to call it to create biomimetic objects for example you can also combine it with other materials such as uh, cloth or string or in this instance uh, cotton wool this uh, to create prototype, sticky string, and fiber reinforced infinity wax. Now, fiber reinforced infinity wax is yet another discovery which again takes this to the next level and it allows for stronger forms to be made so you can actually make devices with kinetic energy storage, for example, a small bow storing a kinetic energy and release. So that's another field of engineering and exploration that kids can play around with, obviously safely, but it allows for the creation, the exploration of numerous different possibilities of what you can make in your reality at a very low cost. You can take in recycled materials and you can combine them. Essentially, it allows it, beeswax connects to anything pretty much everything that we have tried to stick it to. And as a connecting object, it allows you then to explore what happens if I stick this to this. Enjoy it, follow your curiosity, see what is possible, and look at how you can shape your own reality. Many years ago, you're shortly gonna meet Danny, I introduced this idea, this concept to Danny, I showed it to him, and some friends at the Alchemist Hub, along with showing them some very simple techniques, which if you join our Maker Guild and follow our journey, we will actually teach you and show you later. They subsequently went on and equipped their entire co-working space, all of the furniture in the co-working space from the plastic bottles and sticks, but using models that they created with the Benius Infinity Wax. This sent Denny, on his own journey, which he will no doubt talk to you about. I personally have used it to design domes, furniture, cargo bike trailers, all of which I've been able to build in larger uh, forms 
using the plastic bottles and the sticks. So it creates numerous opportunities and possibilities and it allows for very, very, very rapid prototyping. I have witnessed people challenging their own assumptions about themselves and what they are capable of once they start to play with this material. It is incredibly powerful to see what happens when people actually start to make things with their hands again. And I think this is a critical thing which is missing um, from our society. Increasingly, we're reliant on digital technologies to create and produce. And it's very important that we actually learn how to shape the material world with our hands, lest we forget this art and this craft because it's part of what makes us human. We are not meant to continuously and only consume the products of others. We are meant to take an active role in our society to produce the world around us rather than only consume it. So I'm very excited that today you have the opportunity to learn how to produce this yourself because I believe that the world needs it and I look forward to seeing what you build with it and seeing what comes next. I know that this sounds completely wild for something so simple and it's such a bold and radical claim. But with, as with all forms of knowledge, only experience can teach you. So make it yourself, play with it, explore the world with your hands, connect to things in conversation of making Connect to each other by co-creating and bearing witness to how each of you creates differently. How each of you expresses yourself in the world in a different way and relate to it differently. Because once you start to make things together and you look at it, you're going to see that nobody makes things exactly the same. Each of you is unique. For the world is not meant to be something that we only consume. It is meant to be a co-creation. So please join us on this journey of creative exploration and let's co-create a kinder reality.